Hello everyone. If you are watching this video, that means you are going through some sugar cravings, which is very expected. I went through sugar cravings. I know Nicole did as well. And we are here to give you some tips and tricks to get you through the sugar craving cycle that you will break, I promise. Yes. So if you are craving more sugar than normal right now, then your body is going through some detox. That means that your body is killing off with the supplements, it's killing off the bad bacteria in our gut and the yeast that specifically feeds on sugar. So it's dying off and it's like, feed me, feed me, and it wants more. And so it's just screaming for fuel and for food so that it can thrive in your gut. And we don't want it to thrive in your gut. So if you're struggling with sugar, here are some tips and tricks for you. Number one, if you are taking one or two ProBio 5 at night, which is usually the start of our regimens, usually it's one for a one week and then you'll up that to two at night. If you are already taking the two, I do suggest that you add one in the morning with your morning supplements. Do that first thing, that extra enzyme that's in the ProBio 5 will help break down Candida a little quicker and then that way you can eliminate it faster. So that's one recommendation that I have. Yes, and the other way that you can starve it is by avoiding sugar. Now, I know this is hard when you're craving sugar to avoid it, but if you commit to yourself for 30 days and say, I'm just gonna do 30 days of no sugar and really starve that yeast so that my body can be thriving again, it will benefit you so much. So commit to yourself 30 days of no sugar, cut it out and starve that yeast. Number three is gonna be making sure that you're fueling your body, making sure that you're getting your caloric intake and one biggest recommendation I have is getting a good protein slash carb snack or meal. What happens is when we start to have those sugar cravings, our instinct from our brain is to pick the quickest and the fastest thing, which is going to be a candy bar, soda, an energy drink, a cookie. something, yeah, something just very easy on the go. If you can fuel your body with whole foods and making sure that you're getting that caloric intake with a high protein carb snack, your blood sugar will actually go up and then it will maintain and it won't do a spike like this where you start to just keep eating sugar. You're not doing your body any favor. favor. So be sure to uh, be really cautious of what you're eating. We never want to restrict diet to anybody, but these are just some tips and tricks that will help you get through the sugar cravings. Yes, so eating more frequently throughout the day. Um, I know as moms, sometimes like we'll just go long stretches without eating and then we're just craving things and our natural habit is to grab something maybe not so healthy for ourselves because we're in a hurry. So just prioritizing your body and knowing that it needs fuel to, to thrive, right? And then last thing, make sure you're drinking enough water. We want your uh, water intake half your body weight in ounces. So if you tell me that you're only drinking 20 ounces, I'm going to say you better up that water. Yes. Upping that water will actually help the candida breakdown and bio cleanse work very, very well together. And it will help flush things out so that you're actually flushing the candida and not feeding it. So making sure that you're keeping hydrated, well hydrated throughout the day. Yes. And I actually heard this years ago, but I, I don't remember where I heard it, but it was, if you feel hungry, you might just be thirsty. So oftentimes when we are um, thirsty, when we are dehydrated, our brain signals to eat and really you're just thirsty. So drink a big glass of water if you're having cravings and try to drink more water. That is gonna help so much with cravings, you guys. We, it doesn't seem like it would, but it really does make such a big difference. So I hope that helps. I promise you, it does get better. We've all gone through it. Usually about week three to week six is when sugar cravings will be the highest. But if you use these tips and tricks, this will help you get through that kind of candida die off and you'll be on your way to a healthier version of yourself. Yes. Have a good week.